Yes, I heard going, uh, Palu. Very interesting. Three, two, one, go, Charizard! Go! And he just does not like have attack buffs on his switch, huh? <laughs> oh wait, I forgot that it uh it defaults to the end and ID. Or the switch profile name, sorry, I guess it's about an out cold. Yeah, this um Sarato keeping it fairly even overall, barely managing not to get murdered. <laughs> He does play that super aggro Zard, which a lot of people are not ready to fight, typically. Alright, two dash attacks. Super strong move. Woo! He got... He did auto radical and he got flare blitz for that? That's one hell of a punish! Oh yeah, Beast barely surviving uh, that up air. Oh. And what an unfortunate miss space from Beast. Alright, in the back air from Sourdough, gonna take the first stock. Of course, Beast uh, completely ignoring Squirtle's presence in this game. This character does not exist. What is a Squirtle? Ivysaur, on the other hand, is totally a character, and apparently, uh, what unfortunate SD from Sourdough. We need to, to go a little bit higher, he was probably hoping to do that. Oh, I think that was supposed to be a rare back here. And there's the right back air, but he was too. He's a little off in the timing, but you know what? It didn't even matter. <laughs> what is going on? I <laughs> can't even begin to like. Like, what just happened? It just ended? Yeah, Beast uh, coming in, just knocking over Sourdough super hard. I don't know what Sourdough's thoughts are right now, whether it's like, man, I should probably go Zelda, or if he's like, I need to try something else. I don't know. That did not work out too great for that first match. <laughs> Alright, yeah, he went Zelda. Uh, Smashville is a very strong stage for Zelda because she's allowed to use the platform to force people to approach um, directly in front of her. Oh my god! Sourdough, dude! It's okay! 
just barely surviving at 69%. And right there, you can see. Oh, uh, wow. Yeah, no, these flare blitz, dude. The flare blitz to call out the uh, the arm, the bad armor pulse, really good from uh, from Beast. Of course, despite like the uh, super explosive start, um, Sourdough did manage to rack on some percent. So this isn't too bad quite yet, but this could get pretty terrible uh, if Sourdough keeps taking these straight hits in the down air. <laughs> no, that's a super risky uh, spike to go for. From Beast too, because if uh, Sourdough had just gone past the ledge, it would have definitely been a kill. For uh, it would have been a kill. But you know what? You go, you take risks, you get kills. And a character with like multiple jumps has a lot less to fear from um, from the knight overall, especially on the ledge. You know the S smash right in the tailbone, man. That stuff hurts. You can see, like, he has Sourdough on the back foot. He's not really sure what to do. Alright, nice parry. Sick parry. A good dodge. And an optimal punish overall. Very nice. I just did that, like, five more times, and you got the stock, basically. So I was like, is he using Squirtle? Is this going to be a kill? Nah, he went for, uh... I don't think that was frame perfect, but it felt like it was pretty damn close. And Flare Blitz? I don't really understand why, um... I don't understand why, uh, why Beast is shuffling so much between the Pokémon. Whether it's just trying to throw Sourdough off, kind of keep him uncomfortable. Or just messing around a little bit. But, oh, that should be it! <laughs> he kept changing! Not even for, like, any good reason, he just did it. That was... A pretty commanding, um, that was pretty commanding from, uh, from Beast, right? And alright guys, we're gonna have, uh, Vesta Green versus Mega in just a second. It's gonna be an Ike Ditto.